day 1306, counting the days down until the next Bitcoin halving, which is where the supply of Bitcoin will be, not the entire supply of Bitcoin, which this is actually something I would like to talk about this in this video, is the entire supply of Bitcoin is diminishing very quickly, I would imagine, because of the transaction fees. The transaction fees almost burn a lot of Bitcoin, and let me explain how my how I my my thought process on that is that when you have okay, like today, I wanted to move from one wallet to the other just to uh, mix up my security, move funds around. So by uh, sending all my Bitcoins from one of my wallets to another wallet. There is, of course, a transaction fee and an amount of Bitcoin is lost because or, or is still in. I could still keep the keys to the original wallet. So I guess that's on me. That's my responsibility. But at the time, it's like it just seems like such a small amount to have to keep track of all that information. Um, well, that, I wonder if that streak's actually on the screen. That's pretty cool looking. <laughs> um, yeah, so... How much Bitcoin just people lazily like me? I, I left, um, it wasn't much, you know, a couple, not a couple, it was more than a couple of Satoshi in my wallet and then transferred it over. And uh, some of it, some of it remained in that old wallet that I don't have. I, uh, I probably have the keys. I mean, if I really wanted to look, I could find them. But how many people don't do that? How many people have left bits of Bitcoin in wallets and have forgotten the passwords or have forgotten where they've come from. It could be a huge number. So the total supply of Bitcoin is being reduced quite quickly, I imagine. I'm sure people are trading funds around all the time and losing Bitcoin. Bitcoins are disappearing. So will that affect the price? Of course, if there's less Bitcoin supply, the price will be affected. Um, I don't really like transaction fees, but for whatever reason, they're a part of the system and um, it, the system seems to be working. The system seems to be moving forward. Is it a more enlightened system? Perhaps we'll find out. You have to be more careful with your Bitcoins. You can gamble instantly and watch those Bitcoins disappear instantly. And if it was provably fair or not, who knows? But the fact that your Bitcoins are gone forever to some gambling sites, you'll have to live with that for yourself, especially when you see the price go up. You'll be like, man, I just wagered $1 billion on a hand of blackjack. How are you going to feel about that? And I'm asking myself that question because I've lost a whole Bitcoin on a hand of uh, blackjack. I've actually lost a few. So moral of the story is don't waste your Bitcoins. Keep your Bitcoin. Protect your wealth and your wealth will protect you. That's a, a quote. I don't know where I got that from, but it's a good quote. Um, something else I invested a Bitcoin in in the past has been Hashnest which is a Chinese uh, cloud service mining company, and I've never made money with them. I've probably lost as much money, uh, lost as much Bitcoin through them as I did from from wagering. So it has never been profitable, except for the pack mix. I, I mean, those in theory should be profitable. I don't know much about the calculations or whatnot, but it's something you could look into. I just paid for one today. We'll see how that goes. I mean, the pack mix have always been profitable. They pay back your Bitcoin plus a little bit more. It's not much more, but the fact that I'm increasing my Bitcoins passively is great. And that's what I'm going to keep trying to do. Oh, if I put my hand right there, you can actually see me. That's interesting. Wow, it's like going Super Saiyan. So there's just normal me with my hand blocking the sun and then Super Saiyan me. Yes, I like it. All right, that's it for... Day 1306, you can look into Hashnest if you want to invest in cloud mining. Would I do it? I did it with one Bitcoin into their new contracts, their PacMic, their new, I think it's version 6 Pac, PacMic contracts. Maybe it's version 5, I don't remember the exact number. But uh, yeah, I'll let you know how that goes. I'll keep you updated on that as we continue counting.